it's been a bit since I filmed my last video. So much has changed. And I was on such a YouTube like flow. I was posting consistently. And then we moved, which I want to talk about. And I got so busy and it was so hard to keep up with like all the platforms that I wanted to keep up with. So I had to put YouTube on hold, but we're back and I am so happy to be back. Today is a very exciting video. I am gonna be trying on all of the new Glossier G Suit shades that they sent me. I am so excited. I tried one yesterday and I tried one at the event that I went to like last week. Loved it and I'm gonna try some fun colors that I usually don't try on, but it'll be exciting. That way you guys can kind of see how they look like on me and my skin tone and I don't know, just see if you like them or not. And I also wanted to kind of just update you like chit chat while we try on these things. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be a fun video today. I have my micellar water and also cotton rounds because we're gonna need some stuff to remove this because these are kind of like matte, they're demi matte. Um, and I feel like I have a hard time like taking color off my lips and there are some very pigmented colors here, but it's okay, it'll be fine, it'll work out. I am on my period today and it's day two and I feel like day two is always like the worst for me. I'm feeling a little anxious and it's just like, ugh, I hate the way I <laughs> I hate the way I feel and I like to like distract myself. So this is what we're doing So I think we should just go in and get started. I'm not gonna try the one that I tried on yesterday I did a whole makeup look behind it. Um, it's on my Instagram and my TikTok. I will link both of those that way you can go and check it out But this is what the color looks like. This is in the shade lane and I picked it out because I feel like these colors just go well with my skin tone and I think it went well with the makeup that I did yesterday and I loved it so I'm just gonna kind of pick randomly. There's gonna be no method to this. We're gonna go with this one. This is shade Strike. I don't know what that looks like yet. Ooh, very corally. Okay, so this is what the tip looks like. And for reference, I already have Refi Lip Liner on in the shade Fawn because that's how I like to outline my lips. So I'm just gonna wipe this off a little bit. Oh my gosh. I've never worn a color like this. Wow, okay. I get so scared wearing colors like this because I feel like I have a hard time with like lining the outline of my lips. So anyway, we moved. We have a new background if you couldn't tell. Um, we moved in the beginning of March. I moved in with my boyfriend, Trent. Wow. This is, the thing about these is they are so pigmented and although I wouldn't normally reach for this color like it's really impressive how good it looks i like the way the tip is like pointed that way you can line your lips easy wow what do we think strike all right time to take this off anyway what i was saying was trent and i moved in together and it's been amazing and this is our first time moving together and this is my first time like having an intentional move like that so at first I was very overwhelmed and like anxious and nervous and it was just such a blessing and I just couldn't believe that it was happening that I almost felt like guilty about moving and it was very hard to like leave my parents because I'm very close to my parents but it really has been like so amazing and I feel like now the quality time that I get to spend with my parents is even better than it was before. And I love living with Trent. He's like literally my best friend and and yeah, I need to do like a little apartment tour once we have everything together. I need a rug still. We've literally lived here for like two months and I don't have a rug and I want like wall decor. But once everything is up, I'll do like a tour. I just don't want to rush anything and like buy things that I don't actually want. I want to buy things with intention and something that I will want for a long time. So I'm not trying to rush myself. Shade number two is shade shift. This one looks really pretty. I feel like I almost used this yesterday. I am like in shock at how pigmented these colors are. Oh my gosh, that is insane. And this is so pretty. It's like a wine red. It's so weird to see myself in these colors because I don't wear them. So one, we moved, that's an update. Um, another thing is, which is, I can't even believe I'm saying this, but I'm doing content creation full time right now. And that was a very hard decision because I feel like I'm a very, like, I, I worry about the future a lot and I always have ever since I was little. I just didn't grow up in the most, like, financially stable situation, which is totally fine. But 
I just like need stability in my life and when I feel like I'm doing something that maybe it's like more like risk taking rather than stability. I get so scared, but content creation has just been such a blessing and it's like once in a lifetime really, like the opportunities and things that I've been able to do and things that I've been able to experience are some that I could have never even dreamt of. So I decided to at least give it my all for now, see where it takes me. And if I wanna go back and do whatever I wanna do, I'll do that in the future. It's, I'm so excited to be able to do it. Like how amazing is it that I get to make that decision because I want to um, and I just feel so lucky. So yeah, we're doing it. We're a full-time content creator girly and we'll see you. Okay, she's moving on. What color should I pick next? Flip. A pinky color, okay. Never really wear pink on my lips. Especially pinks is pigmented. We're going in. It's important to not be scared. We're just gonna do it, okay. Okay, I feel like this is the cleanest one I've done. So cute, but see, I feel like these colors don't look good on me. But the lip itself is really, really pretty. Is it a sleigh? I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, what else can I update you guys on? I'm like, there's been so much that has happened. Um, my birthday is coming up, Taurus, Taurus girly here, and I am so happy, of course. I love birthdays. I like, I'm one of those people where like, I love when people know it's my birthday. I'm sorry, but I love when people tell me happy birthday. Okay, I didn't even realize which one I picked. This is the shade Drive. Here we go. I wiped too much off on. I need to dip more in. I look like I like ate pudding and forgot to take it off my lips. I should have brought a Q-tip in here. It's getting a little messy, but we're staying strong. These darker ones are kind of hard because you really have to make sure that you line your lips right. And I don't want it to look super smudged. It's not perfect, but you get the idea. This one is really pretty for like a bold night out. I don't know. It's giving like vampire girly. Okay, so I got invited to go to this ephemeral tattoo place, which I don't have any tattoos, um, but it's a place where you go and they'll give you like a temporary tattoo. And it's supposed to last like I don't know, like 13 months or something like that. It's just temporary, but it's like the whole experience. Like they do it with a needle, like it's whole thing. It's just about the ink that they use, which I think would be super cute and fun because the reason I don't have any tattoos is because like me personally, I feel like I would regret getting one. Like I feel like I can't commit to a design or something that I would love for the rest of my life. And that like terrifies me. I love tattoos i think they look so cool on people and i wish i was a tattoo girly but like i just don't know what i would want on me for the rest of my life you know like i just don't want to get something because it's trendy i want to get something because I, I actually like it and i don't know what i would like forever okay picking the next one this is the shade curve Ooh, this is like a nudie pink i think i'll really like this how cute Okay, I have to remember that. I'll put that in like my pile of favorites. We only have three more to try. Oh my gosh. So something really exciting coming up is the fact that I'm planning like a little meetup event and I should be looking at a venue today. Can't wait because I love meeting you guys in person. And if the venue does end up working out, like this one would be like a little pop-up event, which I think would be so cute with like little businesses. I don't know, it could be really fun. It's like a, wow, this one is, okay. The way I go completely silent when I'm putting this on, like I just have to focus. Let's pretend that looks perfect. This is really pretty. I probably would never like actually wear this. I don't think this like is a color that is flattering on me or like my tone specifically, but again, the pigment is like insane on these. This micellar water actually works really well. Oh my gosh, it's our last two. Pilot. What color do I think this is gonna be? I'm gonna go with pink again, Pilot. Yes, I was right. Oh, this is way more vibrant than the other one. I'm gonna be honest, I hate the way this color looks on me. What do we think? Which one is your favorite so far? Oh, actually, wait, we have one more. I've never really put on a red lip like this. This is so vibrant. Can you see? Wow. 
I've always been afraid to put on a red lip, but I like this. Oops, I'm running out of storage on my camera. Um, I need to delete some stuff, but I'll make this quick. I just want to say I love you. I love making videos, talking to you guys, and hanging out, and I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you enjoyed all the colors of Glossier. Yeah, I love you. Thank you for being here, and I'll see you for the next video. Let me know if you guys have any, like, video requests that you want. I think now it'll be super fun to do, like, cooking videos and stuff, so I can't wait to get started um, doing on that, and yeah, go follow me on Instagram, TikTok, listen to my podcast if you haven't hang out with me. Maybe you can come to the meet and greet. I don't know. And yeah, I think that's it for now. Okay. Bye bestie.